Welcome to My Alpha Empowerment, this is Josh, and today's video topic is, when all else fails, act like an alpha male. No, I don't care whatever level you are at with attracting beautiful women. The truth is, guys, all of us, even the best, are gonna come across failures here and there. And how you deal with that failure at that present time will dictate the outcome 99% of the times. So, if you find yourself in a scenario where you let your guard down, your woman started taking the lead, or you just appeared weak and needy and desperate like a little child, a little boy, the truth is, guys, you can flip it around like that. And I found in most of the cases, they are reversible. Sometimes they aren't, but you know what? The majority of the times, you can flip that ship around and be headed in the right direction for success. And like I said, if you're in a situation right now where you might have texted her the wrong thing and you could tell she pulled away, if you hit the reset button on that situation, you assess the situation, and then you figure out what to do to actually change it around. What can you change? What behaviors are actually turning her off? And when you start to look at the scenario and you can't figure out what it is, if you look a little harder, you probably will find it. So if you guys are watching this right now and you're wondering, what is it gonna take to get to the mastery level of attracting women? Well, this is the number one thing I recommend, guys, is knowing how to hit that reset button, okay? If you mess things up, which you will, you don't have to worry about being a failure. You are not a failure. You just made some mistakes. And with anything in life, you have to learn how to get over those mistakes in order to get to that outcome. And whatever you expect, that will happen. So I'm talking about acting like an alpha male. So if you start to become needy and desperate via phone or just in person, it's usually over the phone because she's actually not right there. What can happen is when you start acting like a low ranking male and you start appearing very needy for her attention and over emotional, I mean more emotional than her, there's a problem. Okay, so as I teach her at My Alpha Empowerment, you guys know that a true alpha male really doesn't care what others think about them. And they're not wondering all the time, like, do they accept me for who I am? Are they approving my behavior? The truth is, you shouldn't care about that. So let's say you're on a date with a beautiful woman and she jokingly talks about your car. Say if you don't have a nice car and she's like, oh, that thing's a piece of junk. Maybe it doesn't say that literally, but little remarks start to make you feel a little bit insecure about your car. And let's say you give in to that insecurity and you start appearing a little weak about it and she can tell like you're blushing about it or you're just not comfortable with what she said. Let's say you messed up and you appeared weak and you can kind of feel like she may be a little bit turned off, you're not sure. Here's the thing guys, identify that situation and hit the reset button. Boom, hit that reset button. And before you know it, you can identify that situation and say, you know what? If I'm an alpha male right now, let's forget about the mistake I just made and let's just be confident. Like who cares what just happened? I appeared weak, but you know what? None of us are perfect. Hit the reset button guys, start to act like an alpha male. So that's the beginning part of the date. During the middle part of that date, when you hit that reset button and you start to display higher status and you kind of just let go of what happened, she will then start to draw into you more because she can feel that strength coming from within. So whatever happened, guys, it doesn't matter. The only thing you can do is act like an alpha male. There's no other choice for success. I mean, alpha male is the best you can get. And you won't always turn every single situation around, but you are better off acting like an alpha male no matter what. And all of us are gonna to have to learn how to deal with these mistakes, but it's how you deal with these mistakes. That is how you get stronger. When all else fails, act like an alpha male. That was always the truth, and it still is the truth. Beta male isn't the way to go. Alpha male is the way to go for success. Now I want you to understand this one point right here. Being an alpha male doesn't mean you are perfect. In fact, alpha males will usually admit when they're wrong because they're humble and they understand the philosophy of being a human. 
they're not so hard on themselves and they don't beat themselves up over making mistakes. The alpha male knows that mistakes can be his best friend sometimes. The alpha male knows that he has the strength to overcome any awkward date, any awkward situation, and no matter what happens, he will always be the one to be standing at the very end. Strong and powerful. You know, and this goes with first impressions too with women. I mean, if you really mess up a first impression or you just start stuttering and you just, you appear anxious and it just didn't go the way you really wanted it to go deep down. Guys, I've had this happen so many times where you completely butcher the first time you ever talk to her. And then I've had it where I actually hit the reset button. Weeks later, I'm on a date with her. And it's really not that hard to turn it around. Your biggest enemy is your mind. Because your mind's going to play tricks on you. When you mess up, when you make mistakes, the first thing that's going to hit your mind is, it's over. You don't have a chance anymore. You're done. Just give up and just go sit at home and, and be alone the whole weekend. That's what your mind's going to try to tell you to do. But I want you to start training your mind to say no to that discouragement and say yes to encouragement. You are your best encourager. And you can't turn every situation around, but if you look at life in a positive manner, in a positive fashion, I guarantee that you will have some situations turn around for the positives. And I'm not just talking about getting that one woman. You see, I'm talking about the other women that are out there. You see, you can let one woman dictate your success with other women. How crazy is that? One bad approach can literally hinder you from all these other women that are standing right there in the same facility, okay? So you go, let's say you go to Starbucks and there's a girl in line, you mess the whole thing up, okay? You, you go shopping and you're like, oh, that was the worst approach ever. But what you fail to realize, guys, if you look around, there's other women right there. And I'm not saying you gotta go to every woman and start hitting on them, it's gonna be awkward. But I'm talking about opening your eyes to seeing that one mistake is okay, dude. Like, chill out. You're human. You can turn this thing around. Beating yourself up emotionally. And when you become emotionally handicapped like that, it doesn't do anybody good. And like I said, you focus on that one girl that you messed up with, and what you don't realize is there's millions of girls out there. And I know that statement's so overrated, like there's plenty of fish in the sea. Like when you're going through that situation that went terrible, that is like the last thing you wanna hear. But once you start to get to the mastery level, you will love hearing that statement because you're like, you know what? You're right, man. Like, what was I doing? Like, concerned about this one girl? Like, there's all these other girls that are totally into me right now. And what was I concerned about? Like, it seems so real to me at that time. But Josh, you've opened my eyes up and now I see that girls really do like me for who I am. And not everything has to go perfect. So in summary today, all I'm trying to say is, whenever you mess up, whenever you make a mistake, and whenever you know you aren't appearing like that alpha male, here's what I'm telling you to do. Stop, realize that you did make a little mistake, hit the reset button, boom, ka-ching, okay? And then ask yourself, what would an alpha male do if this never happened? Like, would he still be concerned about the past? I don't think so. What would an alpha male do? An alpha male right now, would literally give a crap about what just happened. He would, you know, keep his head up high. He would smile. He would laugh, like, because he doesn't care. And he wouldn't be trying to impress her and he wouldn't be concerned about if he's won or over because he knows deep down a real alpha male has his choice. And if you have to fake it till you make it, it's better than not doing it at all. Act like an alpha male whether you feel like it or not. And before you know it, it's gonna come from within and it's gonna be natural. But you've gotta start somewhere and I wanna be that help. I wanna help you guys become an alpha male. So thank you so much for watching this video today. Have a great day. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I will see you in the next video.